Okay, so I want to use this TikTok for two reasons. One, I want to get your attention. But the second more important reason is I'm going to use this TikTok to illustrate how as black men were socialized to worship women. Okay, so this is the second TikTok, and I don't want to disparage this young lady, but what I want to do is I want you to hear the young man rapping at the end of this TikTok. So here we go. Big girls, big girls, I must confess. Skinny chicks, okay, but big girls, the best. Girl who built just like a bulletproof vest. Sitting in the club with the crumbs in your breast. Okay, so... Uh, you know, we can hear it one more time, but you hear that she she does the, the prant or what do they call it? Prants when you flip your hair and, you know, and he sees the TikTok and then he's rapping about, you know, how he wants to get with her. We'll let, watch it again. Big girls, big girls, I must confess. Skinny chicks, okay, but big girls, the best. Girl who built just like a bulletproof vest. Sitting in the club with the crumbs in your breast. Okay, so... I, I wanted to illustrate the difference and we're going to get to exactly the difference in just a second, but we have in our community, we have this kind of, I don't know, this unwritten rule, if you will, where we, 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 we worship our women. We, we walk around and we call women queens and goddess and, and there aren't any other cultures that do that. Now I do understand we have sisters and, you know, daughters and, and we want them to have high self-esteem. But high self-esteem is different from planning a false sense of, I don't know, what word do you want to use there? And in our culture, we do that. I'm going to go back to the first TikTok and I'm going to explain to you the difference in how we're acculturated and why in, indeed we are, as black men, raised to raise our, to praise our women, to worship them. So that brings us back to the original TikTok, okay? And I'm not so interested in this TikTok per se as I am in the comments. And so you see one comment that almost got 1800 likes is he says, Nandaro, tekido te daiji danan te kanji. He's basically saying, you, you may not trust my translation skills, but he's basically talking about moderation. And daiji means important. And then so feel means kanji means feel. So I rough translation as i see it is i feel that you should be a bit more moderate right or sh basically shouldn't you be a bit more moderate and then she'll kind of last it off with yeah maybe you're right right and there's another comment and i want to scroll down so you can see it this here and this one almost gets 1100 likes here right and this was a bit more direct he straight to the point he said basically saying you're losing the gravity which is a you know i mean come on you know what he's talking about and you see again you see 11 almost 1200 likes and i'm not saying that is i'm not condoning it what i am saying is that it's a culture that we know in our culture how we deal with women we, we call them goddess and queen and, and, and this, we're the only culture that really does that. We, we, we're taught to kind of worship our women. And so from a, from a young age, we, we, we don't feel the freedom really to, to, I mean, imagine if you had said something like this on a TikTok, some, someone da dancing salacious on a TikTok, right? Looks like your, your, your members are losing the gravity. Or something like, uh, don't you think you should be a bit more modest? What would that, what kind of backlash would you get from that? And just with my time overseas, I can see that we are, we are, are taught to basically worship our women. And so when we, when we have women that, you know, that, you know, that, I don't know, I, I don't want to say don't meet the standard. I, I mean, we, we just don't have the, the freedom to, 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 to be critical. We don't. So, so the opposite, the opposite of what we get is, this is the opposite. This is what we get, right? Girls, I must confess, skinny chicks, okay, but big girls, the best. Girl who built just like a bulletproof vest, sitting in the club with the crumbs in Now, I'm not saying that he's wrong for this. That's not my point. My point is, is that in any form, 
in any manner, we're taught she's a queen, she's a goddess. And we, but at the other side of it, we don't have the ability to say, hey lady, hey young lady, you need to cover up. You need to be more modest. Or even the last comment when he's referring to, you know, gravity, I mean, that whatever. But we, we are not socialized to, to look at our women, our black women that way, right? I mean, if they were our women, we would have the freedom to, to critique them because we certainly know that we're critiqued by black women. But I'm not even saying that we should dislike hater. I'm, th that's not my point. My point is we are not, we're never socialized in our youth to say, hey, you need to cover up. Hey, why you have your breast hanging out like that? Hey, you shouldn't be out like wearing the, those kind of clothes. In any form or fashion, we're taught, oh, she's a queen, she's a, she's a goddess. We gotta worship her as a goddess. And that leads us to basically just not having any control or power over what happens. And it also leads to just in, in any form we see women, we praise them. And so what happens to a lot of young guys when they come overseas is that they meet women and they think, oh, she's a god, she's a goddess. And I think at a, in the be beginning, women are like, oh, wow, this is really cool. He thinks I'm, I'm a god. But at a certain point, they're like, why is he worshiping me? I'm just a regular person. And some of that comes from just the way we're socialized. And so I would, I would say to young men, try and get yourself out of this, I mean, th out of this, you know, thing where you're worshiping women. We're not supposed to worship women. We're supposed to respect women. Yes, but we're not supposed to worship them. So I just want to tell you guys, you know, if you're a young guy and you're out there and you see women, especially when you come overseas, you got to learn that, hey, I'm a man. I got that. I'm the man and I respect you, but I'm not going to worship you because we're not supposed to be doing that. So anyways, thanks for watching. Please like, subscribe, and I'll catch you guys in the next video and uh, take care, guys.